Welcome to the sales training video for Molnica Tortoise Turning and Positioning System used for proning patients. Acute Respiratory Distress Syndrome, known as ARDS, can occur in critically ill patients. Fluid leaks into the lungs, making breathing difficult or impossible, which deprives the body and its organs of oxygen. All patients with ARDS require oxygen therapy and most will need support by a ventilator. Typically hospitalized patients lie in bed on their backs. However, a 2013 study published in the New England Journal of Medicine reported a reduction in mortality of more than 50% from ARDS by positioning patients face down or prone. Placing medically fragile patients into a prone position can be a very complicated procedure that takes an entire team to accomplish. The Molnica Tortoise Turning and Positioning System when used for proning patients, addresses this difficult task with a system engineered to improve the comfort and safety of both the patient and caregivers. The components of the system include the proning pad, two fluidized positioners, one for the body and one for the head, and the tortoise turning and repositioning pad. The proning pad is square in shape and is the smaller of the two pads. Let's take a closer look at the pad components of the tortoise prone system. The main pad has the long black and red handles that are ergonomically designed to help keep the caregiver safe in turning the patient or making lateral transfers. The vertebral image identifies the center of the main pad and is a landmark for the landing spot when performing proning activity. Also, a good time to point out the weight capacity of 880 pounds. The proning pad is square and the smaller of the two. It is used in conjunction with the main pad to facilitate the proning activity and add an additional layer of air under the chest when the patient is prone. For demonstration purposes, the video only utilizes two caregivers. However, it is recommended to follow your institutional protocol for proning. Considerations to include are the number of staff required, usually five or more, specific specialties of the staff that should include respiratory therapy and overall guidelines for managing lines and tubes along with upper and lower extremity positioning. The tortoise pad is designed to address safety issues for both the patient and the caregiver. For the patient, the tortoise provides pressure redistribution to help prevent pressure injuries. The tortoise's ergonomic features help caregivers safely reposition a high-risk patient while avoiding back injury. The tortoise pad has a low-pressure air chamber that adapts to the patient using positive air displacement. The tortoise is the only turning system that uses positive air displacement. The patient is enveloped by the pad, creating a more comfortable experience while redistributing pressure. The tortoise pad plays an important role in pressure injury prevention, as well as serving as a component of the prone positioner system. If the patient is already in the bed on the tortoise pad, untuck the draw sheet and then untuck the tail of the tortoise pad. When planning the direction for supine prone movement and prone to supine, think about where the most critical stationary equipment is located. This will usually guide the direction the patient will be turned. As you will see, it will be the direction that the main pad is moved as it will be receiving the patient. The patient is moved with the prone pad in the opposite direction to create room for them as they move into prone. Remember this for later when the patient is returning to supine. The main pad will be moved the opposite direction, away from the equipment, to receive the patient back in supine. Have a clean sheet, draw sheet ready and within reach for placement on the main pad as indicated in the video. Use the draw sheet to make a micro turn, creating a space under the patient. Insert the proning pad between the patient and the tortoise, making sure the edge aligns with the seam on the tortoise. Perform a micro turn from the other side of the bed using the draw sheet. Pull the proning pad through so it is centered under the patient. The proning pad should be aligned with the top of the tortoise pad to ensure proper placement. Many ICUs find that successfully placing a patient in a prone position requires 6 to 8 people and up to 30 minutes based on their individual protocols. 
And while there are specialized beds for proning, the Molniga tortoise turning and positioning system is significantly less expensive. To turn a patient to a prone position, begin with the patient centered on the proning pad and tortoise pad. Pull the tortoise pad to one side of the bed using the white boosting handles. This will move the patient to the side. On the opposite side of the bed, grasp the handles of the proning pad. Pull the patient back towards the center of the bed. The proning pad will slide easily on the tortoise pad. Make sure to continue grasping the tortoise pad. Now, pull the tortoise pad further over so the patient is lying on the opposite side of the bed. Roll the used fitted sheet and draw sheet toward the patient while placing a clean fitted sheet and draw sheet over the tortoise and tuck under the patient. Reach across from the side with the empty space and grasp the proning pad handles. Slowly and gently roll the patient over onto his or her side and then into a prone position. Remove the proning pad. Remove the old fitted sheet and draw sheet and pull the new fitted sheet and draw sheet out from under the patient and straighten. Use the tortoise positioner pad to center the patient on the bed. Place the proning pad under the tortoise between the fitted sheet and the tortoise. Not only will it aid in future turns, but it adds an extra layer of air to support the patient. Use the tortoise handles to perform a micro turn. Push the proning pad under the patient, being sure to align the top of the two pads. Now loop each of the long red handles on the tortoise through the short red handles on the proning pad. Perform another micro turn using the tortoise to gently roll the patient. Pull the proning pad through and help lock into place by inserting the long red handles through the short red handles. Finally, add another layer of air by tucking the tail of the tortoise under the patient. Use the small fluidized positioning pad to support the patient's head. Molnica's fluidized positioner can be molded away from the patient to accommodate medical equipment or airway clearance. A second fluidized positioner is included with the system to support the patient during micro turns or larger turns. It can also be used to support other parts of the body as needed. To return the patient to a supine position, untuck the draw sheet and untuck the tail of the tortoise positioning pad. Steps to remember before you return patient back to supine. Have new draw sheet, linen ready to go on the receiving side, main pad. Remember to unlock the red handles on prone pad from tortoise main pad. Gently slide the prone pad from underneath the tortoise main pad. Use a small micro turn to reintroduce the prone pad between the tortoise main pad and the draw sheet. And add another micro turn to pull the prone pad through on the other side. Important to note. When returning patient to supine, don't forget to pull patient toward the equipment on the prone pad to have them received on the tortoise main pad that is being away from the equipment. Caregivers on one side of the bed should hold the white handles of the proning pad and pull the patient towards them to one side of the bed. Caregivers on the other side of the bed can use the white handles to pull the tortoise pad from under the patient towards them. Place a clean draw sheet on the tortoise pad and tuck under the patient. The caregivers then reach across the patient, grasp the proning pad, and slowly and gently pull the patient towards them, rolling the patient into a supine position. The proning pad will now be on top of the patient, 
and can be removed along with the soiled draw sheet. Pull the clean draw sheet from under the patient. Use the tortoise pad to center the patient on the bed. Tuck the tail. All components of the prone positioner system can be cleaned using hospital-approved disinfectant wipes. The proning system is designed for single patient use in order to ensure best performance and avoid cross-contamination. The Molnica Tortoise Turning and Positioning System offers ICUs an affordable means of implementing and supporting a proning initiative for patients with ARDS.